Welcome to The Daily Writer, where we share a lesson each day to help you cultivate the habits for creative success. Are you having trouble writing? Do you feel like you can't regain your focus? Do you feel short-tempered or irritable? Whenever we feel this way, the first conclusion we jump to is that we have writer's block or that we're just not creative. But the problem could actually be much simpler than that. Maybe you're just tired. When your body doesn't get enough sleep, you get irritable. Your brain doesn't function as well, and your judgment starts to become compromised, and you certainly can't be focused, disciplined, or creative when you're tired. So maybe you need the same thing that preschoolers need whenever they get cranky. It's probably time for a nap. You know, a lot of people assume that taking a nap is lazy or it's just something that kids do, but many of history's greatest leaders and creative minds were famous nappers. John F. Kennedy, Leonardo da Vinci, Margaret Thatcher, Winston Churchill, Eleanor Roosevelt, and Ronald Reagan were all known to take regular naps. And these leaders realized that they needed to be well-rested and alert in order to function at their best. I take a nap almost every single day. I lean back in my office chair, put a small towel over my eyes to block out the light. I set an alarm for 10 or 15 minutes later, and then I sail off to dreamland. Even if you don't fall all the way asleep, you'll still benefit from taking a break and resting your body, mind, and spirit. The comedian Ben Stein once said, sleep more at night. If it's allowed at work or home, take a nap in the afternoon. You'll be amazed at how much better you'll feel. Well, those are true words for sure. So if you're feeling tired, don't feel guilty about taking a nap. It's actually one of the most productive things you can ever do. Thanks so much for listening to today's episode. For more, you can visit us at dailywriterlife.com. Thanks, and I'll see you tomorrow.